What's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of How to Style. This time we are talking about off the shoulder tops and cold shoulder tops. They're everywhere and I'm obsessed with them and I feel like they're here to stay for a while. So no longer a trendy item. I think we can almost classify them as a staple. Then came the cold shoulder top and I was like, nope, I like the off shoulder top. I am not buying into the cold shoulder top. I fell in love with them. Now I'm making a video about them. They are daytime, they're nighttime, they're casual. So I'm just gonna show you guys three ways to style the off the shoulder and cold shoulder top today. <coughs> As I like joke on my own spit, that's gross. Now let's get straight into the video with look number one. I do this a lot. For my first top, I found this one at Forever 21. I thought it was so beautiful. I am obsessed with the color and I'm obsessed with the lace. Like look at the details on it. I'm like so in love with it. It's just like a pretty top. I think this is perfect for going into fall because the color is like a little bit of a plum color so it's really nice. Today I just styled this with a simple pair of dark denim shorts just to make it a little bit more casual. I tucked it in because the shorts are high waisted. I really love the bottom. It gets like a little bit more detailed at the bottom. I paired it with this gray Steve Madden. You know, when I bought these, I was like, I'm never gonna wear these. I don't know where I'm gonna be wearing gray shoes, but you guys have seen throughout my videos, I wear these with almost everything. They just go with so much, so really good find. I love the bell sleeve. It's got a huge bell sleeve. Once this is off the shoulder, the detailing, like you can really, really see it. It's so nice and it just pops. I think this looks expensive. You know who it reminds me of? It reminds me of Zimmerman because they always do these really romantic lace tops and they run about $3.50. So to find this for, I don't know, I think it was $22. It's like, I have to have it. It's gorgeous. So my next off the shoulder top is this black one from Zara and again same as the one before you can do daytime or nighttime I did it a little bit in between I guess I did it with a black leather skirt because I love an all black look and I love the two-tone of the different materials I love anything that's cinched at the wrist because I can push it up and make the sleeves a little bit more billowy another reason why I love the her life top just saying. I, I thought this was really nice going into fall, but also can still wear it right now because it's so thin and you can push the sleeves up. So this is something that will carry me all throughout fall and winter. And I just think it's a good length also. You can tuck it in or leave it out. It's got a very dramatic off the shoulder. So it's got a super thick band up at the top. And I tucked this into the leather skirt. I'm sure you guys are like, why are you tucking everything in? Because it makes you look taller. I know, it sounds crazy, but it does. I just feel like when I tuck things in, I always look a little bit taller than I am. It kind of elongates you. So, that's why I tuck it in. I don't know, I just think it looks good too. You don't have to tuck it in. It'll look good tucked in or out, whatever. So the next top I did was a cold shoulder top. I know I wore this in, I think either a vlog, no, 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 I wore this in my favorites video, but you couldn't really see it all the way. Some woman I told me that I looked like a watermelon. Thank you, I think, I don't know. Wasn't really my intention to look like a watermelon, but whatever. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, this is a cold shoulder, so if you guys don't know what a cold shoulder is, it is where basically you just have an open shoulder. There's a strap, but it still hangs down. So just your shoulder is open, it's not fully off the shoulder. This one is from Storts. Storts has a lot of really good, cool pieces. There's like a lot of ruffles and textures and print, which I love. I had to have this one, and it comes in a few different colors, but I think this one's really pretty for the summer. And again, I just styled this with a pair of light wash denim shorts because it is so hot. This was the only thing that I could put on my body was the pair of denim shorts. This is a pretty summery top, so I don't think I'll wear this into the fall. I'll probably retire it at the end of August. So I'm trying to get a lot of wear out of it while I can. You can see the details. It's got pleating on the sleeves. And then it's got a little bit of ruffles and then a tie on the side. It's a little see-through, so the bra situation is kind of tricky. I would just do a nude strapless and then be done with it. You definitely can't not wear a bra because like your nipples will be kind of like exposed for the world. Unless you're into that, then just don't wear a bra. You make it look like it's magic. Cause I see nobody, nobody but you 
never confused I'm so used to being you suggestions a lot of you guys like for some weird reason at the same time requested this video I don't know if you like got together and like said let's do this I heard you loud and clear so that is why I did this video let me just say that I am totally hearing your requests on boyfriend jeans and culottes and sweaters today it is 105 degrees in New York I am waiting until a little bit more into the fall to take those requests and I am like all of you guys who are saying culottes you're like my soul sister because I have been wanting to do a culottes video since I started this series. So a culottes video is coming when it's not like so hot. Thank you for your suggestions. Keep them coming. I told you before we have a list of your names and what you're suggesting and we appreciate it so much. Don't forget to follow me on social media. I'm gonna just put them right here. I think I've probably already put them right here for you to see, but they're right here. I am so blown away by your feedback on the lookbook that I'm making. I'm like completely blown away. You guys are so excited, which made me even more excited. Um, so September 1st, the Her Life lookbook is launching. And if you're new to my channel, um, I am making a full month's worth of outfits for you. It's gonna be things that are actually in stores right now that you can click and buy. It just kind of gives you an idea of how to wear them, what to wear them with. So it's gonna be really cool. And I mean, it's coming along great. I'm gonna be so excited September 1st when it launches. So go to lifebyheart.co to sign up for updates and I'm actually gonna be sending you guys an email fairly soon about that. So look out for that in your inbox. That is it for today. I will see you guys in my next video and have a good night, a good morning, wherever you are right now. Bye. And it said it's for severely damaged, unresponsive hair and I was like, that's me. And trust me, I have a cabinet where shampoo and conditioners go to die. This will live on forever. I will keep buying it, it's my favorite. And the brand is Theory, I guess. T-H-E-O-R-I-E, -E, so it's Theory and it's Argan Oil Ultimate Reform Shampoo and Conditioner for severely damaged, unresponsive hair. I shampoo 